Hey guys, on this episode of Titan Training, check out GoPro's new Karma drone. In a recent press conference, GoPro announced not only their drone, but their Hero 5 camera, the Hero 5 Session, a subscription and cloud service, as well as some quick editing apps. Now as for the drone, it has been designed to have a much slimmer profile when folded up for easy transportation. They wanted something you could basically stick in your backpack, or use the backpack it comes with, which is pretty small. It has four wings which fold in, legs that fold up, and the camera is mounted on the front of the drone, which allows it to fit into a much smaller flatter space. The front mounted camera is also placed in a position where it's virtually impossible to see the blades when you're flying the drone. Inside the box comes with the Karma drone, a controller to control it, as well as a handheld stabilizer stick which can be attached to any of GoPro's mounts. This package costs around $800 US which is a good deal considering the handheld stabilizer alone would cost about 500 bucks. I know because I have one. You can also get the GoPro Hero 5 bundle which has the Karma plus the Hero 5 for $1100 US or the Hero 5 Session bundle for $1000 US. There's a companion app a friend can use on their phone to allow the friend to control the camera on the drone while the person with the Karma controller will control the flight of the drone. A few other facts about the Karma, it comes with a 3-axis gimbal that can be removed from the drone and attached to the stabilizer stick. The Karma's top speed is 35 miles per hour and has a top flight time of about 20 minutes. It's compatible with the GoPro Hero 4, Hero 5 and Session. I should note that the Hero 5 and the Hero 5 Session both shoot in 4K as well. What do you guys think about this new GoPro Karma? Are you guys going to pick one up on October 23rd when it comes out? Let me know in the comments below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Until the next one, have a good one.